on behalf of our Yelpy breed. Our next grand champion female from Farm Fair is a two-time qualifier. She won grand champion here at Farm Fair, also was the grand champion at the Old Spall Classic. On behalf of JM, on behalf of JM Nutrend Cattle Company, JC Massey, the Nutrend Junior Division at Strathmore, Alberta, entry 7004, JDH, Ms. 20R Victor, 33Z, 55DET, the two-time qualifier from JC Massey. A three-year-old cow-calf pair with JM Nutrient Miss Vicky 3G calf at side. Another two-time qualifier comes next, and that is our grand champion limousine female. She won Farm Fair on Thursday. She was also the Lloyd Minster Stockade Roundup champion. Boss Lake Ms. Molly 814F, entry 7005. From Kyle and Brittany Boss of Boss Lake Genetics, just outside this city here in Parkland County. Congratulations to the two-time qualifier that was our Farm Fair Grand Champion female. Also winning at the Lloyd Minster Stockade Roundup as part of that Alberta Supreme collaboration between the three fall shows. Our all other breed Grand Champion female here at Farm Fair comes next. And this is entry 7005, Miss Resilvia 7G. She's coming to us from young Emily Yaremko of Carpathian Land and Cattle. Just sold last month from Resilvia Cattle at Derwent, Alberta. Congratulations to our all other breeds grand champion female, the main Anju Heifer, competing on behalf of the AOB. Next is our Farm Fair Grand Champion, Red Angus female, entry 7007 from the Yoder family of Cinder Angus at the County of Barhead. This is Red Cinder Frasia 29E with Red Cinder Bryler Frasia 729G heifer calf at side. This is a first calf heifer with her heifer calf at side. She is also a junior project for Bryn Yoder on the halter of the cow and is our grand champion female from Farm Fair at the show that took place yesterday. Thursday featured the National Shorthorn Show. And when the dust settled and the smoke cleared, our grand champion Shorthorn female is a heifer calf from, Dun from Dungannon Stock Farms, young Nate Rigney and his family of Westlock, Alberta, Dungannon Ginny Maid 3GET is our national champion Shorthorn Female. Congratulations, our grand champion Shorthorn Female, our national champion. Nate, you want to stay to the outside of the ring and just keep going all the way around. You don't have to line up until you're on the other side. Another two-time qualifier is our Farm Fair Grand Champion Simitol female, who also was Grand Champion at Old Fall Classic from JM Nutrien Cattle Company. Once again, it's JC Massey, who drags Tim and Derry or folks along every once in a while to give her a hand. This is the first calf heifer Nutrien Class Act 3E with NM Nutrien Style Matters 7G. Heifer calf at side, our two-time qualifier from Simital here in Edmonton and as well the Olds Fall Classic. And our final farm fair champion comes to us from the ever popular Speckle Park show. She was grand champion on Wednesday and making a lot of friends ever since. This is the yearling heifer INC Brooks and Dunn 7F from INC Cattle Company, the Harassimchuck family of Saskatoon, Saskatchewan, and Ted Stallings along with INC Cattle Company owner on this grand champion Speckle Park female. We move now into our grand champion females from Olds that qualified back in early October. And that would be our Black Angus grand champion female leading the way. The three-year-old pair from 
Merritt Cattle Company, Trent and Janelle Liebrick and family of Radville, Saskatchewan, North Perth Barbara, 507. And the bull calf at side, Merritt Paycheck 9002G. This is the old fall classic grand champion, Angus Female. Macy and Garrett and Carson along for the ride with the work that is now being done entirely by Trent and Janelle, missing all their kids away at school. But it seems like dad got her done. Our grand champion, Charlay from Olds, comes into the ring next. And that is a first calf heifer with a bull calf at side from McLeod Livestock. Cedar Lee Wren, 13E, from the McLeod family of Cochrane, Alberta, with the Cedar Lee Gold Rush 13G bull calf at side. This is our Old Fall Classic Grand Champion, Charlay Female. Our Red Angus Grand Champion from Olds is a three-year-old from Six Mile Red Angus, the Gibson family of Fur Mountain, Saskatchewan, and Sunbury Valley Farms, the Van Curren's of Sundry Bearberry Way, with Red Six Mile Fanny 149D and Red Six Mile Fanny 133G, 330G, the heifer calf at side on this three-year-old cow-calf pair. Our Grand Champion Red Angus female from Olds Fall Classic. And our final Olds Grand Champion female is the Grand Champion Shorthorn female, the yearling heifer from Golden View Shorthorns, the Senetza family of Smoky Lake, Alberta. This is Golden View Rare Ruby 10F. Our Grand Champion Shorthorn from Olds was the yearling heifer from Smoky Lake, Alberta's Golden View Shorthorn. Our final group of champions come to us from Lloyd Minster Stockade Roundup held just a couple of weeks ago. Leading the way, our two-year-old who won the, Re the Black Angus show, Greenwood Vixen JJP17E with Terron Vixen 62G, the heifer calf at side on this pair from Terron Farms, the Adams family of Forestburg, Alberta. Greenwood Vixen, JJP 17E, and Terron Vixen, 62G, the Grand Champion Black Angus female from Lloyd Minster Stockade Roundup. Our Grand Champion Charlay from Lloyd comes to us from Springside Farms at Airdrie, Alberta. This is SH, SH Shania 9E. The first calf heifer with her heifer calf at side, SH, SH, Shania 34G. From Springside Farms, our grand champion, Charlay Female from Lloyd Minster. My truck's a little bit bigger. Hey, now I could do in a field with a deer up on a hill. Steady stare, cross hairs, pull the trigger. Yeah. Double barrel hanging out the right side. Putting bullet holes into a stop sign. Like you do with your boys round the table. Making noise, cause your bluff straight flush big wins. And our 18th and final contestant, our grand champion Scimitol female from Lloyd Minster. CMS Soda Pop 425B from Black Gold Simital, the noble family of Lloyd Minster, with Black Gold Ms. Soda Pop 90G, the heifer calf at side. This is our Simital Grand Champion female. The five year old cow calf pair, Soda Pop 425B, and the 90G heifer calf at side. Ladies and gentlemen, this completes our 18 contenders in the Alberta Supreme. 10 from Farm Fair International, or 11 from Farm Fair International, of which three were double qualifiers. Two from Olds and one from Lloyd. Four more from the Olds Fall Classic and three from Lloyd Minster Stockade Roundup. Folks, please put your hands together for our 18 grand champion females, each of them a breed leader 
and a breed propagator. As our judges go to move forward now, we want to take this opportunity to tell you a little bit more about each of them. And ladies and gentlemen, just a reminder, I should have caught this from the show yesterday, on our Farm Fair Grand Champion female, the third animal into the ring, the white Charley heifer, Kay's Cattle is a co-owner on that. Please acknowledge Kay's Cattle co-owner on that entry 7002 in your show program. So back to the outstanding panel of judges. Brianna and the team at Farm Fair always bring it when it comes to getting the best of our resources to evaluate and adjudicate our show. Well, this year is no different. Our first judge is Anne Brene Burgess from Venture Livestock Enterprises at Carstairs, Alberta. Anne and her husband, Wayne, are involved in both the limousine and the Hereford business. Anne has been a judge at the RBC Supreme at Agribition and has also judged the First Lady Classic out at Agribition as well as the Legends of the Fall right here in Edmonton. Has judged all breeds in Prince Edward Island, Nova Scotia, New Brunswick, Quebec, Ontario, Alberta, and BC. And she's judged countless 4-H shows. Starting her life as a Hereford girl and then into a fitter business, and then being one of the preeminent supporters of the frozen genetics industry for many years before becoming the general manager of the Canadian Limousine Association and now the general manager on behalf of not just all cattle in Canada but all of the other livestock that utilize identification as the general manager of the Canadian Cattle Identification Agency since 2015. We have loved Anne's contribution through the years, from the time she was a McGill University graduate, all the way to her work now on behalf of the industry with CCIA. And she currently has cattle ownership and partnership in four different provinces. Folks, Anne Brene Burgess, one of our esteemed panel of judges. We move now to a lifer, a young man that was born to one of the greatest cattlemen our nation has ever known, and he's turned into one himself, Curtis Fluellen of Fluellen Cattle Company at Bowdoin, Alberta whose primary interest is Pold Hereford. Their operation is east of Bowdoin, Alberta, and together with his family, operate Flewelling Cattle Company. Curtis has successfully exhibited cattle at all of the major Canadian shows, including Farm Fair, Agribish, and the Toronto Royal, and the Calgary Stampede, with the highlight of his show career, winning the RBC Beef Supreme Challenge Champion Bowl in 2004. Curtis has judged many purebred and steer shows across the country, including the National Angus Show right here at Farm Fair, the National Junior Angus Show, and the National Junior Charlet Show. A big fan of, a big booster of junior programs, and an outstanding cattleman in his own right. We're very proud to have Curtis Flewelling as one of our judges. With one ballot, but two judges to evaluate it, and they'll see him the same way. I don't think we're expecting any fights in the dirt. We're very happy to have another couple of lifers, folks who grew up right here in the halls of Edmonton's Expo Center back in its Agricom days, Riley and Jill Mater of Mater Ranches at Carstairs, Alberta, with primary breeding interest in Simital. Riley was born and raised at Mater Ranches in Carstairs, and Jill joined the family operation in 2007. Both grew up in the Simital breed, but also had commercial cattle and other breeds of purebreds. Currently together, they own and operate Mater Ranches alongside Riley's parents and their two children, Stella and Hawken. Mater Ranches consists of 300 red and black Simital cows. 2020 will be the 31st year hosting their annual bull power sale on February 21st at the ranch. There, they will sell 90 yearlings and extra aged bulls. And in the fall, just last month, they marketed bred heifers at their first female sale as well as open heifer calves selling at the Friday Night Lights and Olds, truly one of the great sales in Canada, perhaps around the world. The Maters use the show ring themselves as a major advertising tool to market their cattle to their customers across the globe. They know the sacrifices and hard work that it takes to get to be standing in this ring as a champion. They have represented the Simital ring right here in Hall D four times in the last decade, as well as had some Legends of the Fall champion right here in this ring. Maters, Riley and Jill have evaluated many shows, some individually, but many together across Canada, including breed shows at Farm Fair, Lloydminster, Agribition, and the historic Royal Agriculture Winter Fair. 
They are thrilled to be given this opportunity to evaluate these champions, which all deserve to be here. Many thanks.